just got 10 quick multiple choice questions. Quite easy this one, but won't do you any harm. So number one, what is the shape of a water molecule? Number two, how many electrons can the fourth energy level hold? Number three, what is the standard pressure in kilopascals? Number four, what is the HNH bond angle in the ammonia molecule? Number five, what is the catalyst used to hydrogenate alkenes? Of these three hydrocarbons, which has the lowest boiling point? What is the colour change seen in the oxidation of secondary alcohols? What are the units of concentration? Which has the lowest atomic radius from the atoms lithium to carbon? And the final question, how many moles to three significant figures of sodium ions are there in 18 kilograms of sodium chloride? And now the answers. The shape of a water molecule is non-linear. The fourth energy level can hold 32 electrons. The standard pressure in kilopascals is 100. The HNH bond angle in the ammonia molecule is 107 degrees. The catalyst used to hydrogenate alkenes is nickel. The lowest boiling point of these three is the one with the most branching and so it's dimethylpropane. The colour change seen in the oxidation of secondary alcohols is orange to green. The units of concentration are moles per decimeter cubed, so it's this one here. The lowest atomic radius from the atoms lithium to carbon, well it's the one furthest along the period, and so it's carbon. So the moles of sodium ions in 18 kilos of sodium chloride, first thing you have to do is work out how many moles of sodium chloride you've got in 18 kilos, so that's 18,000 grams divided by the MR of sodium chloride, that comes out to 307.6923 moles of sodium chloride. So to three significant figures, that's 308 moles of sodium chloride. And in every mole of sodium chloride, there is a mole of sodium ions. So in 308 moles of sodium chloride, there would be 308 moles of sodium ions. So there's the answer there.